Hello everyone, bonjour à tous. It's a real pleasure to be here with you for this virtual Open Government Partnership Leaders Summit. My friends, we have a unique opportunity to come together and put an end to the rise of authoritarian and populist politics, to safeguard fair electoral processes and protect democratic freedoms. A lot has changed since Canada hosted the OGP Summit here in Ottawa in 2019. And I want to congratulate the government of Argentina and civil society member Robin Hodes for their work and leadership as co-chairs during this unprecedented time. COVID-19 has changed the lives of people everywhere and maintaining the trust of our citizens has never been more important or more difficult. In a short period of time, we all had to take action quickly to save lives. We had to bolster our healthcare systems, invest in social safety nets, and take steps to foster resilience in our economies. In other words, we had to be there for people in a way that we haven't had to in the recent past. And the OGP's Open Response and Open Recovery campaign has pushed us all to experiment and share best practices to make sure our citizens were being served responsibly, effectively, and above all else, fairly. Yes, the pandemic has challenged all of us, but it has also provided us with an opportunity to become more agile, more open, and more focused on the people we've been elected to serve. The Gouvernement Ouvert n'est pas qu'un simple ensemble de valeurs ou de données. C'est une série de mesures. Des mesures qui, lorsqu'on les considère de façon globale, ont des impacts concrets et positifs sur la vie des gens. Voilà pourquoi on a publié les détails de l'ensemble des prestations d'urgence sur notre portail du gouvernement ouvert. C'est aussi pourquoi on a mis au point une application nationale de notification d'exposition qui a été élaborée et mise à l'essai avec et pour les Canadiens. Une application reconnue mondialement comme étant parmi les meilleures pour ce qui est du respect de la vie privée et de la sécurité. Et à l'avenir, le Canada continuera d'explorer les défis et les possibilités liées au fait de vivre dans un monde plus numérique. We have a real opportunity to work together to make sure this world is more human, more inclusive and more open than ever before. So let's keep pushing. Let's keep working together to protect democratic rights and freedoms, and let's seize this opportunity to deliver the benefits and value of open government to all of our citizens.